Johnny Galecki became one of television's biggest stars, thanks to The Big Bang Theory. But now that the long-running comedy has ended, he's no longer bound by a rigorous filming schedule. This is what he's up to now. It's not easy to say goodbye. After The Big Bang Theory premiered on CBS in September 2007, it ran for 12 successful seasons until the final episode aired on May 16, 2019. With more than a decade of work on the show, it's not surprising that Johnny Galecki has taken his time to leave it behind. He spent the months immediately following the finale regularly posting about the show and his former castmates on Instagram. In September 2019, for example, he shared side-by-side -side photos of himself and his on-screen wife, Kaylee Cuoco, along with the caption, "'What a difference 12 years of fake marriage makes. Love you, mooks.'" Around the time of the 2019 Primetime Emmys, Galecki shared an emotional video featuring clips from the series, as well as a look at its stars working behind the scenes, along with the caption, "'Thank you, Television Acad, for highlighting one of my very favorite moments and sharing BTS emotions and hard work made by all on the crew, writer's room, and staff. Much love.'" A lot of mixed feelings, you know, it's gonna be bittersweet, and there'll be a whole lot of tears on the last, last day. Bidding adieu to The Big Bang Theory may be even harder than expected for Johnny Galecki, considering that the show is already set to make a comeback. After its original run ended in May 2019, the streaming rights for all 12 seasons were picked up by HBO Max. It will arrive there in the spring of 2020 for longtime fans to revisit and for new fans to discover. The show will also continue to enjoy reruns on TBS until 2028, giving viewers plenty of time to watch and rewatch each of its 279 episodes. Co-creator Chuck Lorre said in a statement, "...I am forever grateful to have been part of something as extraordinary as The Big Bang Theory. All of us recognize that 12 seasons of laughter is a gift to be cherished. And now we are extremely excited that TBBT will be joining the HBO Max lineup and be available to both existing and future fans of the show. Laughter has legs." It looks like Galecki and his co-stars will remain part of mainstream audiences' viewing routines for years to come. Leonard Hofstadter isn't Galecki's only long-running TV character. Years before he became roommates with Jim Parsons' Sheldon Cooper, Galecki appeared on Roseanne as David Healy, on-and-off boyfriend and eventual husband of Darlene Connor. In 2018, he stepped back into the role for the Roseanne revival and its spin-off series, The Connors. In August 2019, he posted an on-set picture of himself alongside co-stars Sarah Gilbert and Laurie Metcalf, helping him into a pair of slick black jeans along with the caption, "...20-some years later, I'm still I'm still in awe of this freak-ass carny group who adopted me early on and still learns so very much from each of them whenever in their presence." You take left, I'll take right. Let me do it! You don't know where everything goes. When speaking about the show with Parade Magazine in March 2019, Galecki noted, that's kind of my second home with those folks, and I still have a bit of a high school crush on that character. It was creepy how quickly David re-emerged. Most of it was putting the boots back on, but it was downright creepy. These characters reside in you. After years of starring on one of the industry's most popular shows, it would be understandable if Galecki wanted to take a step back from the business, but that doesn't seem to be the case. For example, he took a minor part in the 2019 movie A Dog's Journey. Additionally, his production company is behind the sitcom Bait and Tackle, which CBS bought in November 2018, with Galecki serving as executive producer. The show revolves around three adult siblings who must step up to run a bait and tackle shop when the family patriarch retires. Galecki discussed producing with Behind the Brand in May of 2019. He noted that he made the mistake that a lot of actors make by assuming that the production process started on his own start date and ended with the wrap party. But as he eventually realized, that's only a small percentage of the process. So I wanted to be more a part of the storytelling. I wanted to be in the room when that seminal idea is hatched. For Galecki, being a part of the process is about fulfilling his desire to nurture and cultivate ideas, and then have pride in the projects that he sees to fruition. Along with being a successful actor and emerging producer, Galecki is also an enthusiastic musician. He's been dipping his toes into that side of the entertainment industry for years, and he's still getting into the groove on a regular basis. He's appeared in music videos in the past, including Dave Matthews' band Satellite and Bad Flowers' Heroin, and he often takes to Instagram to post photos of himself playing guitar on his own or attending industry events with musicians. 
Galecki isn't just a guitarist. He's also been known to whip out the drumsticks, and he's even played on stage in front of an audience with singer-songwriter Randy Hauser, who told The Taste of Country in 2017, Johnny has become one of my dear friends, and a lot of times when he gets through taping, he'll just jump on the bus and go ride with me for a few days. At first, he was a little bit shy about it, but I was like, get your ass up here. I love you, buddy. Hey. Yeah. Are you done talking? I'm, well, I'm gonna make now you step I am, here when you play. put it that way. <laughs> <laughs> Are you done talking? Johnny Galecki may be keeping himself busy with other work since Big Bang ended, but that doesn't mean that he's not also taking time to enjoy a schedule that's presumably a little more flexible. And that means he has plenty of time to travel. Anyone who follows him on Instagram knows that he's shared glimpses at his enviable trips. He's posted photos of himself posing in front of a big red barn in Nashville, standing under colorful umbrella art in Paris, sitting in front of a carousel in Florence, and hanging out barefoot on a rocky beach in Sicily. Wherever he happens to be, Galecki is often joined by loved ones. He spends plenty of time with his friends, who are sometimes famous themselves, such as Connors co-star Sarah Gilbert. He's also made time for family, including an adorable moment of himself with his godson chilling on the star's motorcycle. Galecki has also lately been spending time with someone very special, his girlfriend, Elena Meyer. The two have been dating since 2018 and first went Instagram official in July of that year when the actor posted a black and white photo of himself and credited Meyer for the shot. Since then, they've regularly shared images of themselves celebrating special occasions and enjoying sweet moments together. On Galecki's birthday in 2019, Meyer posted a fun-filled collection of pictures along with the message, Happy birthday to this miraculous man. I feel so lucky every day I get to wake up with him. I love you, mister. Galecki returned the sentiment on Meyer's birthday that same year, sharing his own gallery of images and the missive, Happy birthday to Elena Marie Meyer, my queen, my muse, my friend, my love. You are an incredible light and I will never let you forget it. Galecki and Meyer have also enjoyed each other's company while out and about, including a boat ride during the opening of the remodeled Statue of Liberty Museum. In the corresponding pictures, the couple can be seen posing like the super cool duo they obviously are and sharing an embrace that's almost too cute for words. Some of Galecki's fans have been wondering if he and Meyer are getting married anytime soon, especially after he posted a photo of the two of them and included hashtag Vegas in the caption. Alas, Meyer seemed to quell any speculation that same day by posting a photo with the hashtag not married, although she did add yet and a winky face emoji. While Galecki and Meyer aren't married yet, their relationship has taken a huge step forward. In May 2019, they revealed that they're expecting their first child. Galecki took to Instagram to share the life-changing development, announcing, We are absolutely over the moon to announce that we will soon be welcoming a little one into this crazy and wonderful world. We ask that you please respect our privacy during this celebratory time for us and our families. There truly is love out there for all. We hope ours is the ember of yours, as we feel yours is the ember of ours. Later that same month, the pair relished in a paint splattering party, which is when they found out that they were having a boy. Galecki called it a day that he'll never forget in the caption of a post that showed the coverall-wearing parents-to-be sharing a kiss. The actor has also posted other baby-related pictures since the pregnancy announcement, such as a shot of his Sunday reading material, a book entitled The Expectant Father, The Ultimate Guide for Dads-to-Be. Hopefully that reading prep paid off by December 4th, 2019, which is when both Galecki and Meyer posted on Instagram to announce the arrival of their son into the world. Life isn't always sunshine and roses for Johnny Galecki. In 2017, his California ranch was damaged in the state's devastating wildfires. He said in a statement, My heart goes out to all in the area who are also experiencing loss from this vicious fire. It's never the structures that create a community, it's the people. If the people of Santa Margarita have taught me anything, it's that once the smoke has cleared, literally and figuratively, it's a time to reach out and rebuild. Throughout, everyone's been really supportive and, you know, you kind of have to find the silver linings and the dark humor in it. Alas, Galecki was either unwilling or unable to rebuild his own piece of the neighborhood, and in 2019, he put the property on the market for $825,000, down from the $1.2 million he paid for it in 2011. The new owner would be able to enjoy the 160-acre estate that used to be the home of a 3,588-square-foot log cabin. The property also includes several rustic outbuildings scattered across seven acres of vineyards, an infinity-edge swimming pool and spa, several ponds, and pomegranate, orange, and nut trees. Hopefully, this property that experienced a nightmare fire will become someone's new dream home. 
Johnny Gawecki is incredibly rich, and as long as he doesn't do anything ridiculously foolish, he'll continue to add to his bank account thanks to the Big Bang Theory alone. When the show first hit the small screen in 2007, he was making just over $1 million per season. But that's a mere fraction of the $1 million per episode that he was raking in by the end of the series' run in 2019. In fact, according to Forbes, Galecki was the second highest paid actor on TV in 2018, making $25 million pre-tax in just 12 months thanks to his main gig and side projects. The only person he was behind was his Big Bang co-star Jim Parsons, who banged $26.5 million. Thanks to this staggering salary over so many years, Galecki is estimated to be worth around $100 million. He'll also reportedly continue to make around $10 million per year for the next decade thanks to the syndication of Big Bang, which will keep making fans laugh and keep making its stars a lot of money for many years to come. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Nicki Swift videos about your favorite stars are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.